Hi, Ivan from Cannonball Garage, and today we've got a 720 engine here that we're taking a closer look at. We previously diagnosed a valve train issue that required the heads to come off. Uh, due to our extensive knowledge on McLaren engines, we want to check this bottom end and make sure we're not having some issues here. So this has a flat plane crankshaft in it. In a flat plane crankshaft, you have two pistons that are always going to reach top dead center at the same time. So on this engine, we're going to go ahead and rotate these pistons over. And I'm just doing this by feel. Um, I've got almost 40 years of experience in as a machinist and an engine builder. Um, so I'm pretty pretty adept at uh, feeling this out. We're at top, set, top dead center right now, and I'm feeling the deck height of the piston. I'm gonna rock it back and forth, get it nice and even. I'm gonna do the same thing here. And what I'm noticing is that th this piston is sitting a little bit lower than this piston. And it's kind of hard to see in a video. So what I'm gonna use is a uh, piston deck height gauge. We're gonna rotate this engine over and put this right in the middle of the piston. We're gonna rotate this over until it's at zero, um, top dead center basically. And then we're gonna transfer it over to the second piston and this will tell us the difference in deck height, uh, piston to deck height. So if you look right here, about 18, 17, 18 thousandths of an inch difference in deck height. So this rod is potentially bent or tweaked or compressed in a way that's lowering the compression in the cylinder. It's a ticking time bomb. It doesn't have the strength anymore. We need to get this engine apart and see what's going on in the bottom end. Here at Cannonball Garage, we're going to ensure that this customer gets his engine back and it's going to be able to handle whatever he wants to throw at it.